Hi guys, and welcome to Loon Free Life with your host, Christina, and my man, Greg. Now, right now, he is out doing his work because there is snow on the ground and he might have some early days. Uh, a couple announcements, and also I'm going to be telling you on what I'm having to eat. Now, today, I'm going to be eating ramen. Yes, ramen. You think it's impossible? No, it ain't. Well, let me tell you. There is a thing called Lotus Ramen. And I don't know if you can see the bag at all or read it pretty good. But this is the brand I get. I found this at a natural food store. I didn't find it at Walmart, but Walmart does have pretty good brands. Uh, they have some Pad Thai brands at Walmart. But... When I go back to the other store that I was originally with first, I'll probably get more of those. Because those are a lifesaver for me and I just, I love ramen. I love ramen during the fall season because it's not just warm, but it's also giving you that comfort feeling of food. For me, it does. I don't know for about anybody else out there, but that's what it is for me, comfort food. This one is, I think miso soup it's miso soup and you can either do this one in the microwave for about three minutes you boil it then you can open up your package and put in the uh, the package and then just stir it around for a little bit let it you know baize mayonnaise what, whatever you want to call it in there and then set it off to the side to cool for a bit yes I'm addicted to ramen. Don't tell anybody. It's our secret. Shh. Now another thing is that we are going to go on vacation to where? Disney World. Now let me tell you, Disney World is the bomb for Christmas. Like they go all over for Christmas, for Halloween, for the season of the decorations it is so beautiful and let me tell you it's been a while it's been a while since I've been to Disney World with my grandma last time I went it was in 2015 that's when I got diagnosed with my celiac which it's been a while since then 2016 17 18 19 20 21 almost about this many years I think can't count <laughs> Sorry, but I am so happy to be going back to the most wonderful place on the world and I'm bringing my grandma along Of course, you'll be seeing some videos up on YouTube and stuff, but also we're gonna have a surprise guest You all want to know who the surprise guest is? You're gonna have to wait until traveling day I'll be doing a little bit of a blog on traveling day and all that and We'll have a two hour to sit before we have to get on and everything like that. And uh, I'm pretty excited for this. Like, I know Disney World doesn't have very much for gluten-free people, but I will try to take pictures. I do have an Instagram that should be a link in my bio down there. And also, who knows, me and, me and someone that I'm going to be bringing will probably try something new. Hopefully, a lot of peppermint's going to be involved in the merry miss. Now, I couldn't get the extra tickets because money, what, what, what can you do, you know? But it's just my joy of making the memories there, seeing my grandmother happy, you know, just, yeah. It's going to be very wonderful for me. Like, it's going to be a fresh of breath air. It's been a while, and I can't wait to go. But besides that, let's try our lotus noodles, our ramen. Ooh, this thing's heavy. Okay. I let it. There's leaks in here. There's... I love the smell of this. Oh, my God. I do. I'm just... I'm so happy that noodles came from Japan because, to tell you the truth, Japan makes really good really good soup in my opinion they they make it to where the base is the broth but then they make it very 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 good one day i want to travel with my boyfriend to japan and try all of the soups in the world 
in their district. <laughs> Hopefully. All right. So let's get in tasting of this. Please forgive the slurp mess of the noodles. So I have to put this up to my chest for a little bit. It is a little bit hot, but that's okay. Mm. I do love this. <clears throat> I do love the miso. I do love the leeks in here. I love the vegetables. It's just something for me to enjoy. It's something for me that I love to... What do you want to call it? Not pressure, but precious in a way. Like like the goblet with the ring. Pre my, my precious. Like this is my precious. Food is my precious. I know that sounds silly. But it's my precious. Okay? Okay. But yeah. Also, I'm having a hot chocolate bomb. Which actually worked and it melted pretty good. Which I'm very happy about that. Now, I don't know what kind of type of hot brand of hot chocolate it was. It didn't have any wheat in it or any type of flour. So we're pretty good on that part. So it's gluten free. We got those at Walmart. Also, I don't know. Like, I do like it, but then at the same time, I don't like, I'm used to to original brand that we usually get within the box. I can't remember the box's name, but I can't have that one anymore because of my celiac, but yeah. Oh, and did I mention that my boyfriend's going to be making Irish hot chocolate this year? Yep, it's his specialty hot chocolate, and I cannot wait to try it. Well, I guess I better let you guys go. For now, thank you for watching A Gluten-Free Life with your host, Christina, that's me, and my man, Greg. Have a great day, guys. Bye.